All right, so I'm here with this Dell Dimension L866R, and uh, I can't seem to get into the BIOS quick enough. I'm going to try it one more time, but uh, I'm not really sure which one of these does it. Okay, there we go. There's the setup. Uh, looks like I have just enough memory for what I'm going to do. Actually, yeah, I might actually try to put more in it before I do this. But uh, I want to install Windows 2000 on it. And I think I just locked the system up. <laughs> Trying to get into the BIOS. But, uh, yeah, I think... Uh, you know, if the memory is quick and easy, I'm going to go ahead and knock that out real quick and hope that it works. Be right back. Okay, so I put I put a little more memory in it. And it uh, should be going good now. Um, find my seat here. I'm not going to make you guys sit through all this because that's just kind of cruel and unusual and you'll probably uh, either tune out or skip through it anyway. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and pause this and come back when there's something exciting going on. There's one I'm not used to seeing from a, tr a uh, thrift store computer. It said unpartitioned space. So I'm going to format this with the NPFS partition and uh, I'll come back when something else exciting is happening. Oh, this appears to be a 10 gig hard drive, 9531. Uh-oh, something's happening. Oh, that's happening. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, I guess it's booting into uh, Windows 2000 Professional based on NT technology now. Um, yeah, I'm actually uploading one of the videos right now from my laptop right here. Let's see what is about to happen next on this. See, I'm one of those people that Comcast complains about because I use a lot of internet. <laughs> Let's see what's happened. <laughs> yeah, I put a hundred or I put a second sixty four meg chip in here. This thing probably should have a lot more than one hundred twenty eight megs for uh, Windows two thousand, but uh I'm not sure what just happened, but okay. <laughs> now one thing that's not cool is the monitor you're seeing now is actually a Samsung 22 inch TV and there's a random random cable wire that appears to go outside to an antenna and I thought, hey, cool, I could also use this for TV down here. But apparently, yeah, you know, while that was format and I went ahead and tried, I can't get it to uh, see any channels, so I don't know what's going on. That may be slightly sad, so I got I gotta see where this wire's going to. I can see where it's going to in here, so I'll see where it goes in the basement, and uh, maybe uh, if nothing else, I can tie into my cable because that's on the other side of the brick wall, on uh, to your left where you can't see it. But 
I'll come back when there's something really actually happening here. Okay, now that I've drilled like two holes in my desk for no apparent reason, uh, go ahead and hit finish. Uh, yeah, I wasn't joking, I actually drilled two holes in my desk for no apparent reason. And, uh, see what this does. I have to try to remember the keyboard in my lap is not for the computer I'm working on. Uh, I can't wait to see 640 by 480 on this screen. That's what it just said it was. Something tells me that I'm not going to be getting a uh, my full resolution on this. I might have to download all the drivers. That works. That's a good sign, right? But then again, that's an external sound card, but that might be from Dell since there is no onboard sound on this. This is actually pretty decent hardware. I mean, it's an 866. As you can see, it's not properly set up for... Oh, it actually is. 1024 by 768 usually works on here. Okay, yeah, wow, that's... That's not bad. It's not bad at all. So let's see here. It should say 128 megs of RAM. Blah blah blah. And he... Alright, device manager. Okay, so it's not seeing. Oh, hold on a sec. You kidding me? I didn't have the uh, network cable plugged in all the way. So I actually do have network. The only thing it's missing is that modem and Really, who cares about a modem? Oh. Take me to the internet. Take me to your leader. Yeah, this is actually working. <laughs> this 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 is actually this is actually happening. Uh no, that's not the no, Chrome is not gonna work for that. Done, but with errors on the page. About. Or is it Mozilla.com now? Who knows? I'll find out in a second.
go. Well, this Packard Bell Mouse is very weird. I don't, I don't know how much I like these. That cannot be displayed. I don't know if it's... Yeah, I'm not, probably it can't be accessed from, uh, what is this, 5.5 or 5.0? 5.0, but you know what? We've seen the internet on this. Um, I can't believe how much of this is actually still working. Um, again, again, try to remind us of the hardware. It's got a 9.3 gig hard drive that has uh, 10 gigs used, or I mean 800 gigs used. And uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this. Um, Maybe I might just try to sell the dang thing. I don't know. I don't know what, uh, what else to do. Um, I don't feel like doing a canyon test. Uh, you know, I know what I'll do. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do the uh, canyon anymore, but we can do... try to do. I want I'm thinking about this. Does this even work still? I don't know what just happened. It says it's done, so I think I think uh
I'm gonna go give it a few more seconds before I just give up because this, 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 it's amazing that this much is still working. Yeah, I can't believe that this, that much is still working. It, it seems like it's doing something. But, uh, I, I really have things I need to do upstairs. So I'm going to say thank you for watching this, and have a blessed day.